I like to t -t -t talk every moment. I like to p -p -p pause all the time. <laughs> Sorry, a bit of an in joke, but I had to do it. Hello, my darling YouTube fam. I hope you're well and down day. My name is Rebecca, and it's always a pleasure to see you. Hope you're looking after yourself and being good. Well, you're trying to, that's that's fair enough. Don't forget to check the links down below and also check out the free vocal daily blast to improve your singing. Check it out on my website. I'm hoping the link will appear like magic. Thank you. Okay, I'll stop talking. Let's get on with the video. You ready? Good, good, good. Let's go. Oh, it's the Rocky theme. Gonna. <laughs> oh. Ooh, spicy. Ship it at me. <laughs> Where's it gonna go? Okay. <laughs> getting the riff now, I'm getting the, the hang of that. I felt that one. I like, wow, okay, long introduction. Well, it's probably not long, it's just I'm so used to, at the moment, very, very short songs. You kind of get into it and it's kind of, it's gone. You know, it was right there. I mean, with these songs, there's time to breathe, aren't there? There's, 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 we're kind of used to the formality of the structure of the song. Anyway, I mean, full grit singing. There's no clean vocals whatsoever. So quite, kind of aggressively, the vocal folds come in together. I think it's, I'd say at an estimate, at a neutral to high larynx position, considering, you know, and I think he's mainly on the mix there, isn't he? He's kind of like, it's, it's non-stop, it's like one of those trains that, the vocal train that doesn't stop. And you have to have, for me, the foundations of sing is posture and breath, okay? So with that breath, more importantly, the breath right now, it's just, it's non-stop. Breathe into the lungs and it's just generated from there. It's, it's a non-stop pull and succession, isn't it? And you're feeling it, you know, that attack, those attacks, those very much um, staccato kind of vocals going on here. I'm gonna press play. But uh, I like this kind of like rounded vowels there. Okay. Nice. Yes. 
legato notes that then go into these very slight legato notes where it's just slightly more length into the notes there. Do you know what I mean? So it's not just complete staccato all the way through. It's allowing then the vocal to breathe there with the kind of angst behind it as well, isn't there? There's a lot of angst, I feel. And I like the fact there's a lot of expression and feeling, you know, whether it's singing about love or singing about fear or anguish or things that have happened in the past or, you know, love stories. It doesn't matter as long as you're expressing it in an authentic kind of manner. And I like that, you know what I mean? So very powerful piece where the expression lies and the soul begins to sing, becomes a whole body, the whole being kind of erupts, so to speak. Does that make sense? Of course it does. I know. Thank you for following me. Vocal, uh, the lyrics, I'm like... Ooh, he went, what happened there? Where is it going? That was a growl on top of that then, wasn't there? Gotta love a nice growl. This is nice. Psychedelic. Do I hear strings? Oh, wow. This is really nice. So kind of nice. Time signatures are slightly changed now. Is it almost like the middle eight? Oh. Nice elect. Oh god. Nice electric guitar. Da 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 da. We speak so much with music, don't we? We don't even need to speak with words. The music tells the story. When you delve deep into the ocean of music. It's dramatic, isn't it? Theatrical. There's theatre in this. Crescendo of power and exhilarance and exuberance like no other! Oh-ho! Oh, hello now. Master, master, oh. <laughs> that I've been after. Master, master, promised only lies. Laughter, laughter. Ah. All I hear or see is laughter, laughter, laughter. Laughing at my cries. Okay, back to this. Oh, okay. From here, it's, there, it's on. It's on fast forward. <laughs> oh my god! Uh, block and block, blick block. Listen to this bit now. Shush. It's a siren. Wait for it. This is a musical orgasm now! Okay, now we're going... Here. Oh god, it's electric. Oh my god, look at you! My god, it's getting emotional! Oh my god! That was... Oh, 
all these like slight, sorry. There was a moment then. I felt like at that moment where I went a bit like, cuckoo, um, hmm, hmm. I kind of definitely lost myself in that part of the music. Do you know what I mean? So, and I know you're like, yeah, yeah, we do it all the time. Welcome to Metallica, honey. Where have you been living under the rock? Yeah, I have, okay, so what? Where you kind of, it takes you somewhere if you just encapsulate yourself without without thinking of literally anything else and encompass yourself, surround yourself with the music, whatever that is, do you know what I mean? And then just give yourself physically, mentally, emotionally to that, to any part of the music, all of it ideally. There was something about that moment that I was a kind of like a vortex. Does that make sense? Okay. I like these kind of note bends that he's, that he's choosing, but it's very vocally it sounds aggressive and it's not something i would choose to do myself for example but because i would have fear of sort of having nodules and problems and problematic areas later to come in years but obviously there's a healthy way where you do start off with a clean sl slate you do have to start off learning to sing um cleanly so to speak and then you slowly add in vocal fry you can add in distortion you can then try on different vowels and different vowel modifications and things like that but you have to start small sounds, build, whether it's crescendo, mezzo di voce, anything like that. Um, let's keep going. The consonants so crisp, crispy. The consonants. It's an anthem, isn't it? <laughs> isn't it? I can see fire now. Light, darkness, contrast. What is this now? What's happening? What's that? Oh. I'm glad you found it funny. <laughs> well, once again, what an eye opener of uh, the musicality that, hello, that comes within um, and a beautiful showcase, a beautiful arrangement, structure, lyrical bliss. It's not something I would listen to every day. Yeah, I'm gonna put my hands up and a bit there. It's nice to explore different uh, genres of music and avenues and just in terms of the different frequencies that come out, the the vibrancy of the vocal what the the meaning is you know the power the control that he has and the dexterity and it's kind of like there's a certain like affirmation going on there you know and um the storytelling and the use of dynamics is really really interesting but can i just say the the the, the instruments themselves the music absolutely stunning and i'm not a drummer i'm not a I'm not someone who does, you know, percussion or anything like that. But uh, yeah, I play the piano, ukulele. I obviously sing a lot and do impressions and anything musical like that. I'm all in. And songwriting. So there is, for me, it's like a high appreciation level of musicians who, who are so crafted, who are successful. And even if you're not successful in it, but do you know what I mean? Like homing on their craft. It's absolutely, I can just applaud them all day because it's just, it's literally magic. Although that sounds a bit kind of cheesy and weird, but it's magical just to hear it all come together. That my God, there's freaking hard work behind the doors. You know, a lot of these musicians have been have been doing it for such a long time. It's their life skill. It's their life. It's their passion. It's their calling. Um, yeah. Thank you so much for watching. Hashtag never stop singing. Hashtag you're never alone. And hashtag be yourself. <laughs> Yeah, whoopie do. Okay, lots of love. And thank you to my darling patrons. Thank you for your support. Really appreciate it. And um, everything you do, it's it's well noted. <laughs> it's always very business then. Yes. Okay, lots of love. Bye. <laughs>